start the video. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? It is Janet here, also known as Littlefoot Roar, and I got a new setup thing. You can actually see me better, and we're at a equal angle in Steve! <laughs> <laughs> Stop crinkling bags! I'm trying, I just moved it. But if some of you guys know, some of you may not know, my birthday just recently passed, and Brandon, Corey, and Steve all surprise me with some new lighting and things to use so my video should be a lot better but today you may be looking, thinking like Janet you look like a mess I know I look like a mess <laughs> because I'm gonna be dyeing my hair today some people still like it this color but I it, it needs some love and some some touch-ups and I'm not gonna do this how I normally would do it because it's hard to do it this way and I don't have the patience to do it the proper way so I'm just gonna be doing a good old bottle applicator and applying the color all over my head and I didn't even grab the color I got everything else ready over here but forgot my color so I'll be right back <sighs> back got my color it is still gonna be red, don't worry, and wow, this bang is just like defying gravity. Lately, I swear, my hair has been ridiculous. Sometimes I'll wake up and it'll legit just be like sticking straight up. It's been pretty good lately, but uh, ugh, those roots are bad, and especially my bangs because my hair's been growing a lot quicker with the shorter hair. Anyways, I'm gonna mix this all up. And let's get started. Did I grab the wrong one? Ah. Yeah, this is supposed to come with an intensifier, but oh well, we're we're gonna go with it. I grabbed the wrong hair dye, but it's it's still red. So we're gonna go with it and uh, see where this takes us. I think I grabbed the. Zero hero, just like that. Zero hero. Yeah, eye level. Cause science. <laughs> I can't. I'm trying to do this so you guys can see this, but it's not working out so great. So I'm gonna just. Set this down and do this over here real quick. You never want to waste products, so you always want to roll it down. Since I have a lot of hair, I have to use the whole container. And I will put down in the description what I normally get, not what I'm using today because, I mean, I can still put down what I'm using today, but <sighs> it's not what I usually use on my hair. I usually use a uh, Joyco on my hair as well, but the girl is a little tight on her budget, so we're going with this product instead. Oh, man. This never gives me that much of a pink. Why are you being a pink in the butt? And I personally like the bowl and brush method better when it comes to working on myself. I prefer the bottle, mostly because. I make a mess on myself when it's the bowl and brush. And uh, <laughs> since I'm filming in my living room, I'd rather not make a mess. Yeah. Alright. It's good enough. No, it's not. I hate wasting color, so we're just gonna. Ah! Yeah. I'm gonna kill myself. 
Also, I do recommend wearing gloves while doing this, but I have very clean hands and I struggle doing so with gloves on, so, you know, just living the life. And we all know my, my soul's red as well, so a little red doesn't hurt. So what color I'm going to be able to get out of this tool. And then I'm going to put that back in. Off. And usually what I'll do as well is I'll add in a splash more of developer, just a tiny bit. It usually helps out with the mixing a little bit better. So like I'll fill it up just below where I need it to be and then I'll add in that tiny little splash. And now we shake! Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. <laughs> Also, with one I usually wear, that one mixes very well with the bottle applicator. I've never... This one I've only used with a bowl and brush, so, uh... We'll see how this turns out. Also, I don't want to get, uh, Rick all ruined, because, uh, you know, yeah, I get eel sauce. Just shesh one sauce. So, change it into tank top, because, uh, T-Rexes hate push-ups. Don't you know? <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to put some gloves on and we will start applying the color. Now to make every hairstylist cringe, including myself, but you know what? We're just going to go with it. And usually, you're not supposed to apply it at your roots first. But whenever I use this stuff that I'm using right now, I usually just kind of apply it like <laughs> conditioner or shampoo, to be honest. It just looks like I have a little silly string all in my hair. But I do always go along my edges first. This is the first time I'm dyeing my hair with bangs, so it's a little bit of a new thing to me. But I'm gonna stop talking and just have you guys watch it. And if you hear me talk again, something funny happened or I just have a comment to make. I don't recommend doing it this way because it is does get very in your face with the smell but I love the smell of hair dye the only reasons why I am going to cosmetology school also because I've always had a love for doing hair even if it's doing it the wrong way and I actually already learned color in school and so actually doing it this way is making me cringe a little bit but again as I stated because I'm doing it all by myself and there are some people in the world that can do bowl and brushing themselves but I can't as a, I mostly just don't have the patience because doing it this way works a lot quicker I do suggest combing your hair before doing this too that is one thing I did not do to be honest I don't think I combed my hair at all today but uh you know you just go you just go with stuff
sections. And then I end up working everything through the hair even more to make sure I got every little section of my hair that needed to be covered in dye. Since doing it this way does leave the risk of not getting any parts of your hair. usually do. So I take my hair and twirl it all up. And that also lets me know how saturated it is too. And I give myself little space bar. We wait. Also, it looks like I had color on my face, but I just have really rosy cheeks because my ring light brings out everything, all my pimples, my bruises, everything super easily. And I'm gonna go wash up my hands real quick and then be right back and we'll see if my hair is washed or not or maybe I'll do something weird in between. I'm back guys and I have an outfit changed. I changed into my onesie. <laughs> because I'm probably going to bed after this and so I just figured I'd get my previews but I have not looked at my hair yet I have to do the reveal with you guys alright Yoda you finally left the box ah! I'll put a clip of what we made out of the box and Yoda's been absolutely loving it So, now we saw some very cute cats. Let's see how my hair turned out. <laughs> there we go. Back to my redness. Let me grab a brush to brush my hair. My phone just yelled at me, telling me that it's dying. I don't know, phone. I know you're dying. And since I already had the colors going before, like the different tones, I guess, well not tones, but different layers of lightning, it still gives me that dimension, even though I just went over everything. My bangs are super curly. So they're gonna look like crap right now because I'm not gonna blow dry them tonight. I'm just gonna let my hair air dry because I usually do right after I dye my hair. That's not something that you have to do, it's just a personal preference. There you guys go. Here's my dyed hair all done and ready to go for the day. Well, not the day, but and I'm having a birthday party this weekend. Whoop whoop. I'm not really that big of a party. It's just to get together with friends and we're just gonna chill. But now my hair is gonna look different pictures. I was gonna originally do it for my birthday. But you know what? Birthday already passed. So here we are. But hope you guys enjoyed this video today. Let me know what you think of my new light setup. And don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts. My Snapchat is xcrunner1105, and my Instagram is the same exact thing. <laughs> Anyways, love you guys. Peace out. Later. 
Bye.